Lines. Three, two, one, go! Ladies, drivers in the final smash now relying on their vision systems and their pre-programmed systems. They cannot see directly, but let's see what they're able to do in the sandstorm period here on Planet Primus. Cheesy Poops trying to line up on that hatch panel. We have some hatch panel cargo delivery. Cargo delivery is on the Red Alliance side, successfully dropped off by the Red Alliance robots. Red Alliance is at 23 in the lead after that sandstorm period. Cheesy Poops to get their hatch panel plays. We have some defense coming in from Deep Vision. They're going to be the defensive robot here. Cheesy Poops trying to make it back to their loading zone and grab a hatch panel, but that first one doesn't pick up on the blue lines. Looks like we got the Misfits playing the defensive role. Quicksilver, they're lighting up a hatch panel on their cargo ship, and they successfully score that hatch panel for two points and opening up that cargo bay for use on the Red Alliance side. Red Alliance is leading by two points. Difference of only one hatch panel right now. And here comes three more points from the Red Alliance, delivered by Quicksilver. That's a piece of cargo delivered. One more hatch panel placed now by the Cheesy Poops. Red Alliance at 33. Blue Alliance at 33. It's a dead tie with a minute and a half remaining in the match. 9.32 on the Red Alliance. That's Iron Claw. They have some cargo. They're trying to make their way back to that cargo ship, but they're being blocked off by the Misfits who can't let them through. We've lost a hatch panel on the Red Alliance side. 9.72, Iron Claw. They're trying to get that cargo in place, but the hatch panel's fallen, so not able to do so. We've got two pieces of cargo placed. On that blue line side, one came in from the Cheesy Poops and one came in from the Bay Orangutans placed in that blue line's rocket. Blue line's now in the lead by five points. Just over one minute remaining. The Misfits now still playing that defense. 972, they're hung up on that field border on the hump between the red and the blue side. But they're clear, freed up now and they're back with the cargo headed back to the Red Alliance cargo ship. 254, they've got two pieces of two hash panels on the other Blue Alliance rocket. They're trying to get that cargo placed, but they're still being defended against by Deep Vision, who's not letting them through. They're going to be aiming for one of the nose cone places on the cargo ship. Cheesy Poops trying to get lined up and score that cargo. T minus 35 seconds remaining, but that cargo still not scored by Cheesy Poops. There is scored now by Cheesy Poops for three more points. Cheesy Poops pulled into the lead, but the Blue Alliance leading with 52 points. Now, Red Alliance has two pieces of cargo placed in that Red Alliance rocket with two cargo panels as well. Team has 20 seconds remaining. It's still less than a 10 point match. Climbing aboard, climbing up to the higher platforms. Good, make all the difference. 254, looks like they're up for a 12 point climb and it's a quick silver as well, up for a 12 point climb with team minus seven seconds remaining. Very close match, 972. They're on the platform for three points, and just at the last second, we've got the Bay Orangutans on for three on the Blue Alliance side. Red Alliance pulls ahead with three, two robot robots on the platform as well. Alliance. Blue Alliance with a score of 73. Red Alliance with a score of 62. Both teams earning 18 points for the Hab, climbing no penalties in that match. It will be our number two seed of the Alliance that wins the first finals match here at.